So you're going to attach the top and just thread it on. Go ahead and stick these into the soap solution first. Turn on the power button. Open your valve. And you're going to want to press down on these buttons and watch your level because if you go over what the amount is in the jar, it will spill into here. So you just need to do about halfway for soapy water. And then I switch over to your bleach solution. And run that through for the other half. Okay, and then you turn it off. Go ahead and detach that. Take your air hose off. And then you can go ahead and dump back into your soapy water uh, container. And you're gonna wanna use less soap than I did because now I have to um, put it back into the bleach solution and rinse it out so that we don't have soapy milk. And then go ahead and hang these back up for them to dry. If it's easier, you can take off the top. jar bag, put your lid back on, that you want everything to dry, so you're just gonna wait until the morning to attach everything else. And for your waste water, once you get done with everything, you can put both of the waters into one bucket, and then either pour them behind the milk barn, or somewhere on the driveway where you don't we don't want grass to grow because this solution will kill the grass